Volleyball and basketball are high-impact sports. They demand a lot from your body, especially your knees. Every jump, pivot, and landing puts stress on these complex joints. Healthy knees are crucial for explosive movements on the court. Whether you're spiking a volleyball or driving to the basket, your knees absorb tremendous force. Protecting your knees can make the difference between a winning season and a sideline setback. Taking steps to prevent knee injuries should be a top priority for all athletes. Knee injuries are common in high-impact sports like volleyball and basketball. These injuries can sideline even the most talented athletes. The ACL tear is one of the most frequent knee injuries. Sudden stops and changes in direction can cause this ligament to tear. Another common injury is a meniscus tear. Twisting or pivoting forcefully can tear these cartilages. Patellofemoral pain syndrome involves pain around the kneecap. These injuries can lead to pain, swelling, and instability. Recovery often requires significant time away from the sport. Preventing knee injuries starts with a proper warm-up routine. Before hitting the court, it's essential to prepare your muscles and joints for the demands of volleyball or basketball. A good warm-up increases blood flow to the muscles, making them more flexible and less prone to injury. Begin your warm-up with some light cardio, such as jogging or jumping jacks. This will elevate your heart rate and warm up your muscles. Follow this with dynamic stretches that mimic the movements you'll be making during practice or a game. Arm circles, leg swings, and torso twists are excellent dynamic stretches. Focus on stretching the muscles surrounding the knee joint. Hamstring, quadriceps, and calf stretches are particularly important. Hold each stretch for at least 30 seconds and never bounce while stretching. Proper stretching improves flexibility and range of motion, reducing the risk of strains and tears. By incorporating a consistent warm-up and stretching routine into your training, you can significantly reduce the risk of knee injuries. Remember, a few minutes of preparation can save you from weeks or even months of rehabilitation. Make warm-up and stretching non-negotiable parts of your training regimen. Section 4. Strengthen your foundation-targeted exercises. Strong leg muscles are essential for supporting and stabilizing the knee joint. Incorporating targeted exercises into your training can help prevent knee injuries. Focus on strengthening the muscles surrounding the knee, including the quadriceps, hamstrings, calves, and hip muscles. Squats are a fantastic exercise for strengthening the quadriceps, hamstrings, and glutes. Make sure to maintain proper form, keeping your back straight and your knees aligned with your toes. Lunges are another excellent exercise that targets multiple muscle groups in the legs. Step forward with one leg, lowering your body until both knees are bent at a 90-degree angle. Hamstring curls and calf raises are great for strengthening the muscles at the back of the leg. These muscles play a vital role in stabilizing the knee joint. Don't forget about core strengthening exercises. A strong core provides stability and balance, reducing stress on the knees. Incorporate these exercises into your training routine at least two to three times a week. Start with a weight that is challenging but allows you to maintain proper form. Gradually increase the weight or resistance as you get stronger. Section 5. The Power of Plyometrics – Training for Impact Plyometrics involve rapid and explosive movements. They improve power, agility, and shock absorption, beneficial for preventing knee injuries in volleyball and basketball. Box jumps are a classic plyometric exercise. Jump squats are another effective exercise. Lateral shuffles and cone drills improve agility. Use proper technique and landing mechanics. Gradually increase sets and intensity. Section 6. Listen to your body. Recognizing and addressing pain. Preventing knee injuries also involves paying close attention to your body and recognizing the signs of pain. Pushing through pain can exacerbate an injury and lead to more serious problems. Learn to differentiate between muscle soreness and joint pain. Muscle soreness after a workout is normal, but sharp or persistent pain in the knee is a red flag. If you experience pain during or after activity, stop and rest. Ignoring pain signals can lead to more significant injuries down the line. Applying ice to the affected area can help reduce inflammation and swelling. If the pain persists, it's crucial to seek professional medical advice. A doctor or physical therapist can assess your condition and recommend the appropriate treatment. Early diagnosis and treatment are essential for preventing long-term complications. Remember, pain is your body's way of telling you something is wrong. Don't ignore it. Addressing pain promptly and seeking professional help when needed can prevent minor aches from becoming major setbacks. Section 7. 
the winning team athletes, coaches, and medical professionals. Preventing knee injuries is a team effort that involves athletes, coaches, and medical professionals. Athletes need to be proactive in taking care of their bodies. Follow the prevention tips outlined in this essay and listen to your body. Coaches play a crucial role in creating a safe and effective training environment. Encourage proper warm-up and stretching routines. Teach athletes proper techniques for jumping, landing, and changing direction. Monitor athletes for signs of fatigue or pain. Medical professionals, such as doctors, physical therapists, and athletic trainers, provide expert guidance on injury prevention and treatment. They can assess an athlete's individual needs and develop personalized plans. Seek professional help for any knee pain or discomfort. By working together, athletes, coaches, and medical professionals can create a culture of prevention that prioritizes knee health. Remember, a team approach is essential for keeping athletes healthy and on the court. Let's work together to make knee injuries a rarity in volleyball and basketball.